Hey everyone, it's John, and this is going to be a review on this Everly Stock Fanny Pack, and I'll kind of answer some questions that I had when I was first looking at this pack. So, first of all, my thought process for getting this was to be able to carry off body um, for places where I wasn't necessarily wearing clothing where I could carry my firearm. So maybe I'm going to the gym or the river, beach, something like that, where you're just with some clothes where you're not necessarily going to have a belt to be able to carry a holster. And I wanted a place to be able to carry a firearm with a very, very small bag that's very easy to throw on. And a question that I had about this, of course, you can wear this in a standard fanny pack configuration around your waist. But the thing that I really wanted was something that I could wear cross body. I just think that that looks a little better and may even give you better access to the firearm. And so for just kind of body context, I'm about 6'2", 175 pounds. And with this extended all the way, as you can see, I've got the buckle pretty much all the way here at the end. You can sling this over your shoulder and it will stay right here on your chest. And then what I do, I'm a left-handed shooter, but if you're right-handed, you would just want to put that the other way. I've got this the little pull tab here. I can pull this open and easily get in here to access my firearm. And it's actually a pretty quick draw. It's about two, between two and three seconds. And I think you could get that down to a pretty, pretty even two seconds uh, with a little bit of practice. So that actually, I really like. It stays pretty close to your chest, even with a larger sized firearm. I'm actually able to fit, I normally carry a SIG 365 in here, I'll just kind of open up this. This is the main compartment that has the Velcro lining. It does come with this little uh, retainer here for a firearm, just to kind of keep the, the trigger covered and keep the firearm in place. I've been using the Maxpedition Sneak Holster um, in, in this, and I just think that that offers a little bit more protection and retention for the firearm, and it also has a little slot carry an extra mag as well but you can carry i've had no problem fitting a sig 365 in here i've had no problem putting a glock 19 in here with the holster now you do have to camp that going this way a little bit it can't be straight up and down and if you are fine without having a holster in here and you just want to set a firearm in here i even got a glock 20 with a tlr1 in here so this is actually more spacious than you than i was expecting it to be and i just thought that was crazy that you could fit a full-size 10 millimeter in here just going sideways so if you did want to carry this into bear country and have a glock 20 with you you can do that. So that's the main compartment here that's got the, the Velcro. This is a very nice wide strap. The thing that I like is, especially if you're carrying a little bit of a heavier firearm with an extra magazine, this is wide enough that it kind of disperses that weight a little bit that you don't get any hot spots on your shoulder when I was carrying it. Then we've got a big compartment here on the front, which I actually really like. This is such a useful compartment to put phone, keys, things like that. They've also got this up here, which could be used for a tourniquet. I will probably end up carrying a tourniquet up, up here. And then kind of like an admin pouch in here. We've got some more pockets. So you can carry your wallet, keys, you know, chapstick, just things that you want every day in here. And then we've got a secondary pocket here. This is a smaller one, but this would just be something if you want to keep something separate from the rest of it. Like maybe you just want to keep your keys in here so that you know, hey, my keys are always in this pocket and everything else I'll just kind of dump in here. But that's a quick overview on this uh, fanny pack. It's worked really well for me to be able to carry off body in places where I normally just wouldn't take a firearm. And so for me, that's definitely been a huge win just to always, I'd rather have this on me, uh, even though it's off body than nothing at all. And the quality is the same that you would expect out of any Everly stock bag. I've got some other of their backpacks. Zippers feel really good. All the stitches look really good as well. This is definitely a very quality, uh, quality bag. So that's a quick overview on this. Hopefully that was helpful. Thanks so much for watching. Enjoy the rest of your day.